Do you know that sleep is actually considered the small minor death? Because according to the correct verses of the Quran, your soul and its attachment to the body in your sleep is not exactly as its attachment when you're awake. Allah says it in the Quran. الله يتوفى الأنفس حين موتها والتي لم تمت في منامها Allah takes the souls away two times. When a person dies, soul is gone. And when a person sleeps, the soul is taken. How? I don't know. But it's not exactly like that death. It's a smaller, minor death. Do you know why? Allah says, فَيُمْسِكُ الَّتِي قَضَى عَلَيْهَا الْمَوْتَ وَيُرْسِلُ الْأُخْرَى إِلَىٰ أَجَلٍ مُسَمَّى Allah says that when you getting up in the morning, Allah sends back. In fact, He holds the souls of those who've passed away in their sleep. So it's gone. And if death is not written for you in your sleep, you know what He does? He actually sends that soul back for a period of time. Because you still have life written next to your name. That means when you're sleeping, your soul and its connection with the body is not the same as when you're awake. Now when you get up in the morning, Allah's just given you a new day. Allah has given you what? A new day. In order to prove yourself to get closer to Allah and when you go to sleep that next day, by that time you would have known, did I waste my day or did I use it correctly? If you wasted it, the loss is yours. فَكُلُّ النَّاسِ يَغْدُوا فَبَائِعُ النَّفْسَهُ فَمُعْتِقُهَا أَوْ مُوبِقُهَا Every single one of us, we will come out. We have to actually get up in the morning. We have to do something. We have to go out to achieve. We, we are breathing. We go to work. We do whatever through the day. You can never ever survive unless you get up out of your sleep and out of your bed. Because you need to eat. You need to go to the bathroom. And so on. And you know what? Allah says, well, during that day, you either sold your soul to the devil or to Allah. Basically, that's in a nutshell the meaning. It's up to you.